YouTube. YouTube. So, yesterday the kids got to have a lot of fun, and they actually, we have at my work, we have a Bring Your Kids to Work Day. And since obviously what I do for a living, my kids can't follow me around, they set up a day of activity showing the kids and teaching the kids some of the things that I do on a day-to-day -day basis. So, obviously, there's a pretty good consensus about what their favorite part yeah. was. What was your guys' favorite part? The Are batons. You, yeah, the batons. Yeah. So, go ahead and take a look at that real quick. It's kind of funny. Oh. Give him orders, Selena. Oh. Give me your lunch money. Oh. You gotta tell him to get out. Come on, Selena. Give me your lunch money. Oh. Give him orders, Selena. Tell him to get down. Tell him to get down. Tell him to get down. She's in this. Oh. No, nah, she's just Tell him hitting. to get down on the ground. Stop resisting. Okay. Yeah. You gotta speed up. Yes, Ooh. Right, good. Okay, not above the head. Where are you? I'm right here. Look at him. Come on, can you see him? Get down. 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 Get Okay, so the kids got to, to beat up one of our uh, deputies with the batons. Did you guys have fun doing that? Yeah, it was fun. Why do you guys like that so much? I don't know. It's like a good therapy. Like, yeah. You can get your anger out on a guy that yeah. is padding, you know, in a way about hurting them. Now, you were hitting him kind of like you were fencing. Yeah. That, yeah, because I was kind of watching your, your technique, and I was like, that's not how they teach us. Well, they taught us how to yeah. really do it afterwards, like after yeah. everyone got a chance to beat up the guy. Yeah. So, and Selena, you were actually, you looked like you had some pretty good technique, but you know you're supposed to give verbal commands. Were you not giving any verbal commands? No, it's embarrassing. No one does. No one, <laughs> no, one, no one yelled? Almost no one. It's yeah. like, you know, sometimes when police officers actually do use batons, it's hard because they get into a zone and they are not seeing the big picture. And so sometimes it's human nature to not do what you're supposed to do. Right. And that's why sometimes they have lots of bad situations with batons. So... What else did you guys enjoy? Am I yelling in your ears? Yes. What else did you enjoy? CPR. You had CPR with the fun CPR? Go look. No pulse. What do we do? 911. Perfect. After 911, what do we do? Right here, right Try between the, uh, the chest. Like this. And then just start pressing. Do you guys want to practice? Good. Yeah. Interlock them and Kinda then hard, just start huh? pressing. Cool. So go ahead and try. Just like exactly. Nice. Like a real shape. Yeah. Yeah. That's what it really is. That's perfect. Yeah. yeah. You're going to press hard. And you come straight down. There you your go. Have to, your cool. arms have to be straight. How, 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 how long do you do that for? So you have to you. Come on, try it. Perfect. Yeah. I enjoyed watching the dog. Like, yeah. there was this dog named Tank who was like a bomb technician bomb dog. dog. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And like, they had this odor in the box. Yeah. There was like several boxes lined up, and then they let the dog out, and the dog ran to the one with the odor in it, which was kind of interesting. That's though. cool. Yeah. So he was actually looking for like bomb yeah, smelling bomb. stuff. Yeah. So our canine patrol, they actually don't just look for drugs, they look for all kinds of things. And there are certain dogs that are trained to look for explosives, other dogs that are trained to look for narcotics. So you, you really enjoyed learning about the dogs? It was kind of cool. Yeah. <laughs> it's that right one? Yeah. Is that it? Is that yeah. it? That's it? Yeah. Sure. Yeah. 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 Is that where I put it? What is he doing? He's telling you that it's in there. He's telling me that it's in there. Very good. Is that where it's at? You think? He's like, yes, it is. So what you're going to do is, take the ball. Good ball. Oh. Good job. Thank you. So, this is what they work so hard for, is this ball, right? Like, do I work for balls? No, I gotta get paid, right? This is how the dogs get paid, right? He does all this work so that he can have. He's like, give me the ball. Give me the ball. This is fun for him, right? Right? Fun for him and me. That's what these dogs do. They have high drive, they have high play drive. He's like, they yeah. want to be rewarded, they want to please me, right? So I make life good for them, right? We play, and we groom them, and we train all the time, so they're really, really good at that. Tank's been doing this a long time, right? So I get, again, I'll take some questions and then you guys are going to be done with me, yes. By how long do you mean like long, like 10 years or like... Okay, so Tank's just... been with me since 2007, Tank's nine, he'll be 10 pretty soon, and he's going to retire. So they were for between seven and eight years, sometimes upwards of 10, but when I got Tank, he was only three years old. Yes. In dog years, how old is he? Well, five for every year, so five times eight, 
40. 40. 40. 40. 5 times 9. 45. 45. So I was a little worried when my kids went uh, to my work day because I didn't get to actually spend the day with them. So I was kind of bummed about that. But did you guys have a good time? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Um, I liked learning in the dog thing that there's not only German Shepherds, there are police dogs. Yeah, we have all there kinds of dogs. There are black labs and yeah. there's a different kind of um, shepherd. And they use beagles. Really? Yeah. They have beagles, yeah. For some types of, uh, because smaller areas, they need dogs that can um. get into small areas. So I'm glad you guys had a good time. And did you guys learn more about what I do for a living? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And you got to see my commute? Yeah. I mean, mm -hmm. It's funny because I get up at four o'clock in the morning and I had to get the kids up at four o'clock in the morning and they're like, really? We have it to was, get up this early? It was tiring. Yeah. And then I don't get home till almost five o'clock at night. So I have a very long work day and I sit in a lot of traffic and the kids actually got to see what I do on a day to day basis is why I'm so tired and grumpy sometimes. Right? Yeah. It was, yeah. It was very tired. So they actually, they want to go back next year, and I hope, you know, I was asking them to take a lot of pictures for me, and they didn't really do that. So I'm Really? Kind of, yeah, I'm kind of bummed that I didn't get a lot of pictures, because I'm, you know, I like my pictures. But until next time, YouTube. Bye. Bye.